بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم اللہ رب زدن علماء صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم لگارتھم لیکچر فور ٹو ڈیز ٹاپک لگارتھمک ایکویژنس ان دس سیکشن وی ول لرن ہاؤ ٹو سالو مور کامپلیکیٹڈ ایکویژنس اٹ از ایزنشیل وین سالونگ ایکویژن انوالونگ لاگس دیٹ آل روٹس دیٹ از آنسرس آر چیک ان دی اوریجنل ایکویژن This is the standard form of the logarithmic equation. If we have log a m equals to log a n with coefficients 1 on both the sides, then we can equate uh, the functions of the logs since the bases are same. So if we have single log on left side and single log on right side with coefficients 1, and the logs have same basis we can equate their functions but don't cancel the log just equate their functions in this case you know uh, lg has base 10 so bases are already same since the coefficients of logs are 1 now we can equate m to n in ln the bases are same so we can equate m to n and the coefficients are already 1 I mean, these are the logarithmic equations forms of all types of logs. An important note is there: before equating the functions of logs, make sure there uh, should be single logs on both the sides with coefficients one. This is very important before equating the functions of logs. You need to check uh, two things: there should be single log on both sides and with coefficients one. Before solving uh, questions of logarithmic equation, and let us uh, re- revise the rules of all three logs. Uh, the, here are some important rules regarding all three logs. If we have same numbers, then the answer is one. If we have ln e, the answer is one. If the we have ln lg ten, the answer is one. I mean, these are important rules we uh, which will be used in solving the logarithmic equations. Now, let us solve few examples of this. Uh, logarithmic equation topic to solve this equation we must have single log on both the sides we have single log on left side but we have two logs on right side we need to use laws of logarithm to convert these two logs as a single log we i think uh, and we will use quotient law according to this negative sign to convert this these two logs into single log So by using the quotient law on right side, we have ln five upon x. Now we have single logs on both the sides with coefficients one. Therefore, we can equate their functions as five minus x, five over x. Now, one very important thing regarding this: don't cancel the logs. Just equate their functions. I mean, you don't need to cancel these two logs. you just need to equate their functions this is very important while solving equations of logarithmic equation uh, of this type of equations so by solving this we have x square minus 5x plus 5 0 we need to use quadratic formula as uh, we won't be able to factorize this so by using the quadratic formula we have uh, x i think plus 5 plus minus uh this should be 25 minus 4 ac 21 hence the solutions are 3.62 1.38 now we have to check our answers our answers must satisfy both the logs so with the original equation and this is the original equation so we need to copy the original equation here we need to check the answers mentally i mean you just need to check the answers mentally so i mean for your understanding i'm going to check it by substituting the answer into original equation so if we will substitute 3.62 here this log is positive here this is positive so this answer is perfectly fine if we will substitute 1.38 here this log is okay and this log will be perfectly fine so both the answers are perfectly fine you don't need to show the uh, calculation for checking the answers as you did you used to do in modulus functions here you just check the answers mentally
सो दीज आर दी रिक्वाइड आंसर्स 3.62 और 1.38 पॉइंट थ्री एट नाउ लेट्स टू अनदर एग्जाम्पल ऑफ दिस टॉपिक इन दिस एग्जाम्पल वी हैव टू मेक इट वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट दिस नंबर इन द फॉर्म ऑफ एल एन so that we can equate the equation uh, logs on both the sides and we have to use uh, quotient law here to uh, convert these two logs into single log answer so by using the quotient law on left side we have x upon 2x now we have expressed left side as a single log here we can write l and e as i told you l and e is 1 so we can write 2 l and e this is to make to as a log form so now we have coefficients one on both the sides so we can equate these two functions x plus 2 x e power 2 now we need to work for x so we have now by taking x common we have 2 upon e square minus 1 and its uh, numerical value is 0.313 in three significant figures since we have only one answer so no need to check the answer let's do one more example of this logarithmic equations before completing this topic okay let's solve this question a 2 lgx plus 2 equals to lg 2x plus 19 we have sh- we, sh- we have to use uh, power law on left side to make the coefficient of left uh, this log 1 this is perfectly fine just leave i mean copy this log now since we have same coefficients 1 on both the sides therefore we can equate their functions the function of the logs on both the sides so we have x plus 2 whole square 2x plus 19 this is equation number 1 now we need to solve this for x so we have x square plus 2x minus 15 and after factorization factorization we have x3 or x negative 5 now we have to check our answers with the original equation so if we will substitute 3 into equation number 1 uh with the logs will be fine i mean no log will be negative so with 3 this log is defined now let us check the next value which was x minus 5 i guess so when we will substitute minus 5 here we will get minus 3 that's the problem and then we will part substitute this minus 5 here i think we'll get 9 this log is okay but if one log is not fine i mean it's rejected then the whole equation will be rejected is not defined so you need to reject this answer hence the final answer is 3 you need to mention the final answer that's all we have done the logarithmic equations uh, now the last top uh, i mean two topics are left of logarithm one i mean second last topic is exponential equations and then linear law so good luck we will do the remaining topics in the lecture next lectures allah hafiz